Hey guys, so I, I'm back at it again. I'm, I'm going to be upgrading my minivan a little bit, but I actually got this product uh, for my truck, my camper truck build. And uh, you can click on a link on the power source that I had in, in mind for that. But I bought this for the, the camper truck. And I'm thinking, shoot, why, why does the truck get all the new toys? I want to use this in the Sienna too. So I'm going, I can only camp in one car at a time, for goodness sake. So I'm going to use this for both my truck and my Sienna because it's a new, shinier, and, and better product, really. So what I got here is this Bouge RV portable refrigerator. And let me show it to you. So this one is bigger than the one I previously had in my uh, Sienna. This one is a 20 liter, and the Sienna I think is a 16 or 17 liter. So. so anyways, this this is my new one, and it's got these straps, so if you uh, want to have a build with those drawers uh, that you slide in and out, this works great because it has these straps to, to hold it nice and secure. My, my old one doesn't have that, but I mean, I didn't use it for that purpose. But anyways, uh, let's take a look at this. Okay, so let's take a look at the inside. Okay. Got like cables and manuals and stuff. So of course there's an AC adapter you can plug into the wall if you want. Uh, but I'm going to be using it in 12 volt mode. Let's look at the inside. So nothing special, just a, it, it's deeper than my, my old one. It's about the same, you know, um, bottom footprint. It's a little bit longer, but it's deeper. So that, that's real nice because I could really, I have that space to spare upwards, but I don't have um, the space to spare uh, on my footprint. But another real nice thing about this is I could take it out into the campground and uh, there's this, this little um, storage space here. And the storage space might not seem like a big deal to you right now, but I, I don't have it yet, but later there, there's a battery pack that I'm going to put right here. The battery pack is not in stock right now, but I'm gonna get it later. Uh, so the battery pack goes here. So you can put the battery pack here and basically have a portable fridge that's also powered. You know, that's really cool. I haven't seen that in any other fridge. So that's cool. I'm gonna give it a shot and I'm gonna install it in the Sienna. All right, so I'm here in the Sienna and here's my previous refrigerator. And like I said, it's only um, 16, seven, 16 liters. Um, and as you can see, you know, it's, it's really, uh, the footprint is not much smaller. It's about the same, it's a little bit smaller, but what, what, what it doesn't have is it, the depth. So the other one will raise a little bit higher. So I'll be able to use pretty much the same space and get uh, more storage space in my refrigerator. So this one is going away. Let's compare the old with the new and you can see the old the new one is higher and the footprint wise it's really about the exact same width um go looking here you can see it's just a hair longer too but you know being more square and all you can see it's gonna be more space efficient um so with really about the same footprint i'm gonna get a bigger refrigerator and just like magic, the new one is in. You can see pretty much for the exact same footprint, I could get a bigger refrigerator, but it's higher than my previous one. And again, you know, it opens up real nice, no problem. I mean, I can't open it up with the arm down, of course, you know, it gets stuck, but lift up the arm, open it up. And then I got my nice uh, new refrigerator that's bigger and better. Again, there's that storage space which I'm good, it's gonna come in handy when I get that new battery that turns my refrigerator really portable where I don't even need to plug it in. It'll have its own power source. So I'll show you that when I get it. And of course, if you haven't noticed already, the added feature is that it's already, it's already perfect for my um, armrest cup holder thing because there's already holes. So the other one was a little curved. So putting um, drinks on that was a little bit dubious, but this one's gonna be nice and flat. So, I mean, it's not going to withstand hard braking or acceleration, but it should be good enough for 90% of the stuff that I do. Uh, this flat surface uh, over here also has some things that I could put down and it'll kind of grip. So I think it's going to work out great. I'll leave a link in the description if you're interested in this refrigerator.